I'm going to do another boil test today. I'm going to be using a BioLite stove and I'm going to try to boil five gallons of water in this old surge milker that holds five gallons of water. It's stainless steel and I'm going to use that nice stable base of cinder blocks. I propped it up a little bit with 2x4s just to give it the right height. So I just put the water on, the, on, on top of the stove and it's at about 50 degrees. That is a lot of water. I don't know how cold it is out here but I'll, I'll let you know in a little while. I'm just going to keep the fan on low because I want the fuel to last as long as possible. So I've got the timer running and we'll just we'll see where this goes. You can see a ring of bubbles forming on the bottom right over top of the stove there. So I just added some fuel and it's burning really well. Hopefully we're going to be boiling sometime. I had to empty out the stove and restart the fire. It just got completely full of ashes. I had kept adding fuel and it just got too full. hard to see through all that steam but it's just coming to a boil now I put a piece of aluminum foil on top of the heat module to reflect some of the heat off of it so that it wouldn't get too hot and get damaged or anything So I was able to bring five gallons of water to a boil, but it took an awful long time. It's been not quite two hours, so that doesn't seem very practical. I'm just imagining if I wanted to disinfect a whole lot of water or cook a giant meal or something. We have used this milker in the past to make what we call milk can dinner. We cook it over the open fire and we put cabbage and all sorts of stuff in there. Sort of like a family tradition. So I just wanted to know what it would be like to maybe boil some water or cook something over the BioLite stove. Could be done, but I think it would take an awful long time.